Thomas Allen from ShootLighter.com. Today's video is being recorded with my Fujifilm X100T. I've got the TCL X100 adapter on it, which is like a 50 millimeter equivalent adapter. I'm shooting at f2.8, I believe it is, so it gives you an idea of what kind of bokeh you get from using that setup. And I've got natural, I'm using natural light. I've got a window to my right. It's uh, like partly cloudy, but it's mostly nice outside, so it gives you an idea of how much light I'm using. I've got one um, room light that's illuminating the back left over here where the red panel is at. But that's about it. Um, and the audio is being recorded with a Rode Smart Lav Plus, which is a lav mic that you can plug in to uh, an external source to record your audio. I am using an old iPhone 4S that I have in my pocket right here to record the audio and then I'll sync it up after the fact in uh, post-production and I'll be editing with iMovie on my iPad Pro. So, so recently a friend and coworker of mine gave me some red potatoes that she had bought at the farmer's market. We both like to cook and so from time to time we'll share ideas and she brings in things and, and whatnot. And so I wanted to say thank you, and I thought that it'd be fun to record a video of me actually cooking the potatoes that she gave me and show her exactly how they came out and how much I enjoyed them. And then I got to thinking about it, and I thought, you know, this would be a great video to record for you guys as well to show how I recorded it and what I recorded it with. Now, for the video that I'm about to show you, I actually recorded that with my iPhone 6S Plus. And the way that I did that was... I used my Manfrotto Pixie tripod and my S1 shoulder pod, which is a, a clamp that you can use to hold your iPhone onto the tripod. There are unboxing videos and links to both of these products in the descriptions if you're interested in looking into them. And for lighting, I used the D8 selfie ring light, which I recently picked up from Amazon. I think I paid for like 35 bucks, something like that. Um, and this is pretty cool, although it's designed for a selfie, selfie photo purposes it works just as well for the front-facing camera. So what I did was I just clamped it on. It's got three settings, a low, medium, and high. Uh, I believe I only needed like low and medium settings most of the time. And then I just sat this right next to the pan, angled it down, did my recording. Same thing for when you see me cutting the potatoes, and it worked out pretty good. I did not use an external mic for this particular video that I created with this because I knew that I really wasn't going to use the audio from that, that I was going to add music after the fact. So um, any audio you are hearing is just from the internal mic. I think at the end uh, when I'm talking, I should have put an external mic in, but I didn't really think about it. But anyway, live and learn, right? Next time. So if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. Um, if you have any questions, please let me know in the comments and I'll see you next time. Thanks a lot and enjoy the video. Very good.